guys, Kara Shai here, and uh, this is uh, doing the last part now of my wolf haul video because obviously saving spending money for Florida, so cutting back on spending what I like to buy. But I would look forward to buying the subs as we go to Florida. And um, Max wanted to be in the last part with me, the talking Max. So, but he's he wants to rest his voice today, so he's not going to talk. <laughs> but anyway, I will show you the first feeds. Um, my husband got me these, obviously, you know, the sub subs, they do plush, but they do like little rubber figures you could collect as well. And they do in packs of um, maybe one, two, or two, like, and, or five, and you get an S secret one, so you don't know what character you're going to get. So these are the ones I've actually got right now at the moment. I've got Pluto, I've got Fumper, Sully, Mike. Cheshire Cat, Baymax, Patch, Marie the Cat, Sven, Anna, Tramp, Lady, Tigger, Winnie the Pooh and Rue and they're really cool, they do smell a little bit funny because they're rubbery but they're really really cool and what's cool about them, you can stack them there you go, ta da! You can stack them anyway. And they're really cool, collectible little things, and I like them. And you can get the others, ones that I crossed I've already got, but you could get some super rare ones which are gold, which are okay, but you can't see much of them. They are cool, but you can't see their faces, but they're really hard to get. But I really want Stitch, but I guess it's one of those you have to just by luck get him, obviously. But yeah, that's the some some guys of my little figures are so cool. Now moving on to other stuff. These I got from my little my little pony comic and it's uh, Pinkie Pie and Flourish right? and they're quite heavy for the erasers, but they're really good razors made into them. I don't want to use them and ruin them, they're just so cool, so I'm keeping them my package to go on my little pony shelf. And obviously it looks my friend Beautiful Husky and that's me because we're so kind of like our characters from the My Little Pony show. So, <laughs> yeah. And over here, my husband David, he got me this Disney collection book and it was on in the shop called The Works, which is like a bookshop. They were selling it on, put on sale because they're trying to get rid of most of their stock. So, this is my cool collection book. And you get stickers in it, it's like um, stories and things, and yeah, stories, and like do some like colouring here and activities, and what's that page I like? Oh, here we go, there's like stickers as well, so that's really cool. And underneath it, I got Disney The Lion Guard Busy Book. And it's like you've got a story here of like to do with Kion and his friends. It goes on. And then you've got a plate mat there. And you've got the Lion Guard figures figurine set. But I will not use the play mat. I'm only going to keep them on my shelf because they just would look awesome sitting on my shelf in my um, room. So that's what they look like. You put on the mat. But I'm not using the mat. So that'd be cool use that and here's my two McDonald toys Duke he's so cute and fluffy and Buddy and so cool. I don't know now if my McDonald's now have stopped getting the others I just need Max and Gidget but I don't know if they get stopped getting them now or not I have to check my McDonald's again I will on the Friday because they usually change the toys but if I am I'm missing those two out and Thank you, my friend Vespa, for trying to get me Gidget and uh, Max. But like you said, your McDonald's have sold out of them because so it's so popular. But I can't wait to do a uh, trade with you for my mail when you get uh, Derek the cro alligator or crocodile because they didn't do, do them over there. So I had to do that. But yeah, they're so cute. But if I don't get Max and Gidget, at least I've got these ones and the others to go with my talking Max and Gidget. So I'm happy with that. And I've got a money tin. These ones you have to open with a tin tin opener or can opener. And it says cuddle addiction. And at risk for a kiss. Got these from my work and I've written that. This is a second tin and when we fill up our fill up my first one of saving money for Florida. So <laughs> spending money. 
and then and moving on he and he got he also got me these dizzy frozen stickers got over 700 stickers which they all look like that so I can't wait to use them and I got these to, uh, cool books which is um, on our McDonald's Happy Meal boxes you get these vouchers uh, to use at w a bookstore called W Smith's and um, you could get the book for um, for what was it a reduced price so they like, got these for two pounds uh, two pounds so it's not bad so it's like meet the pets like tells you about the character oh doesn't want to stay open like so you've got snowball just tells you about the characters what they're about and where they live and things and this one's an activity book so you've got colour pages oh I love that one Max <laughs> but it's got all the activities and stuff so I like that one and he got me these sticker set of the Secret Life of Pets you get an album with it and you get these stickers they say they're reusable but I don't like to touch them in case they rip when they come off so and you get a cut out to keep so that's really cool and he got me this colouring set for the works bookshop because of clearance I got stickers with it and, and coloured pencils and that I could take off and use as a door hanger but it's like different colouring pictures and he got me this little <coughs> notebook I haven't opened it yet but got this little notebook which is so cute it's like, it says I'm impressed which is Chloe and there's obviously don't get out much and it's like got sticker sheet with it so I'll have to look at that and see what it's like but I love that and I got this from my work I got this um it's like a 3D colour um, build excuse me about the light reflected sorry build and you build this box and you can colour the characters in and then you um and then you can make little stats and then you can use that to put your pencils in a ruler pen and I need that sort of thing because I do a lot of drawing I like drawing I've got lots of pens and pencils so that's going to be quite handy to build and fun to colour in and you've got me a colour play pack it's, pencil. it's like the My Little Pony one but it's uh, this version obviously it tells you about them like right, Max a pampered terror mix Terry Mix, he knew he'll need to find his courage before he can find his way home. Uh, Snowball, Fleet of the Flush Pets, it's so really cute, also insane. And Duke, he's a massive butt. Cake tea saves from the pound. Max is his new best friend, whether he likes it or not. So I've, I just about could read that because of that over it. But it's like, come in the pictures. And you also got me this sticker pad. You've got stickers here, but you've got like different pads. Oh, I want to show you the one like that. It can stick where you want, so I like that. And he also got me Disney Art Academy for the 3DS. It's really cool. I had a go with one joy of doing Minnie Mouse. It's a really good game. It's um, it's like Pokemon Art Academy, but it's just a Disney version, and you can draw Disney. That did carry you what it also gives you lessons through the game as well, and then you could draw your own if you want to copy, and you can add sparkles to the pictures. So, I've only done a little bit because I'm trying to finish Pokemon Art Academy off, but this is a well worth game, and I, I love it. And, and there's my dinosaur. This is a um, uh, talking Arlo, uh, my husband David got me, and he does actually talk. Oh, it's so adorable. We go with my good dinosaur creature. I love it. And uh, before I end this video, guys, I've got one more thing to show, but I forgot to get it. I'm but back. I will be. This right. is what I wanted to show you. It's my uh, Ghostbusters car. We went with my with David and his sister yesterday. We went to see the real well, not the real Ghostbusters. It's called the Ghostbusters movie, the new one that's got the females in it. And uh, we got this with a uh, popcorn in the combo. So this is a cool cup to keep. 
And I, what can I say about the movie? It's really, really good. We really enjoyed it. It's very different. I was it doesn't follow up after the second Ghostbusters movie. It's like a new like alternative world sort of different thing. But it's after further years of the Ghostbusters. And the females, it did really, really good. I mean, it was really unique to have the females. And we really enjoyed the movie. And I recommend going to see the movie if you like Ghostbusters. I mean, there's some people out there who are not too happy because there were females in it, sort of thing, and not the same. But it's remember, it's the different version movie of Ghostbusters. So, got obviously remember, but that people have their own opinions of what they think of it, if they like it or not. I mean, I loved it, so that's my opinion. So, I hope they make a second of this, obviously. But guys, I hope you enjoyed my last haul video and um, yeah, it's sort of a goodbye to it, but not forever because when it gets to my birthday at Christmas, I will do a haul video then, but I will do some other videos. I will have videos or maybe I'll be showing my collection videos of like the line guard, kid and guard sometime and some things and show my um, my dizzy my drawings. I do my sketchbook and that sort of thing. So whatever videos I'll be to think of doing. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you have a nice day. And take care, everybody. Bye.